You see this over my shoulder? This is what people are calling the future. It's the Faraday Future FF91, and it's a lot more than what they had to show since last year when they came to CES and really just showed off their modular platform. This year, they came with a physical production car that we can see, and with that comes a lot of bold claims. A really fast 0 to 60 time. It wants to put a lot of traditional automakers to shame. The Chinese-backed, California-based startup has officially revealed its first production vehicle, and it's called the FF91. The aerodynamic crossover looks to change the way we look at mobility with unprecedented connectivity and capability. The FF91 is powered by a massive 130 kilowatt battery pack that produces a whopping 1,050 horsepower and provides up to 378 miles of driving range. For reference, the range-topping Tesla Model S P100D offers a 100 kilowatt battery pack with 315 miles of range. Faraday's incredible powertrain gives the FF91 a 0 to 60 time of 2.39 seconds, which is faster than any Tesla, any production Ferrari, and most sport bikes. That's not ludicrous, that's downright unbelievable. Faraday says the crossover is the world's first ecosystem connected car, meaning it links to all your mobile devices and can stream an incredible amount of data to its HD screens through a dual antenna Wi-Fi system. Because of this, the car is also a rolling hotspot. Packed with autonomous features, the FF91 wears a dynamic sensor system that would make the USS Enterprise jealous. With 10 cameras, 13 radar sensors, one 3D LiDAR sensor, and 12 ultrasonic sensors in total. With these systems working together, the FF91 can drive and even park itself, although the system admittedly did have a few issues during Faraday's live demonstration. There's no word on how much the car will cost, but those interested can invest a $5,000 deposit, which puts them in the running to score one of 300 Alliance Edition models. Delivery is expected to be in 2018. Will Faraday indeed be the future? Time certainly will tell.